Hello there, my Sagittarius Collective. I hope you're having a fantastic day. My oh, my Sagittarius. What's up with this energy with you? Mm. Sagittarius, be mindful of the energies that you tap into. That Five of Cups and that Three of Swords. My oh my. What's up with you in regards to relationships, partnerships, Sagittarius? What's up with you in regards to relationships or partnerships? Why you got Six of Cups? Oh, well, you a missed opportunity. There you go, Aquarius energy. Oh, with the Five of Pentacles. You were a missed opportunity, uh, Sagittarius. There's the Ten of Cups. There's the Moon. There's the Six of Pentacles. There's the Eight of Cups. My, oh, jeez. There's not a lot of love energy around you, Sagittarius. What the fuck is up with that? What's up with that, Sagittarius? <clears throat> okay. So, you got the Queen of Pentacles and you got the Scorpio card. My, oh, my. Over that, you got the Three of Cups. You got the Six of Swords. And there's the Two of Cups. Ooh. You started with the Hierophant energy. Over top of that Two of Cups is the Queen of Swords. With the Fool card energy. My, oh, my. Sagittarius. Sagittarius, some of you, there could have been a catfishing energy around you. Uh, the Three of Cups, the Six of Cups, the Two of Swords, the Queen of Cups, and the Fool card energy there. So, Sagittarius, those of you, right? Make sure you're not being catfished. Do you know who you're dealing with? Do you know that sort of energy? I think Aquarius uh, really kind of brought in some really interesting energy with you. Especially in regards to your spirituality. Uh, Sagittarius. Sagittarius, you could have been in a relationship or partnership and someone didn't like the fact that you were, uh, dating somebody. So this is like some old school energy here, Sagittarius, you know what I mean? So, damn. I don't feel like there's a lot of love. So I don't know what you got going on, Sagittarius, but, right? You got the Three of Cups, you got the Six of Cups down there. There could maybe be some androgyny on this. Definitely be mindful. Know who you're dealing with. Take what you're Sagittarius, leave what the fuck isn't. What's over this energy with you? My oh my oh my. There's too much unknown energy. So that's the sort of vibe with you. So in regards to relationships or partnerships, right? You better be asking some questions and... Figuring out what it is you want, what it is you're looking for. So you don't waste your time, energy, or effort. Sagittarius, for some of you, someone's religious beliefs could actually be a factor. I don't think it's a factor for you, but that could be sort of a factor going in around you. You know what I mean? So you got nine hermit energy. Cut away what is no longer needed for you. Some of you could definitely be getting out of relationships or partnerships. Some of you, there's like, know who you're dealing with. Definitely be mindful of catfishing energy. Because that, uh, that really feels like catfishing energy. Six of Cups, there you are, Sagittarius. My, oh my, you got a lot of admirers. Above that, you got Judgment. There's that Page of Wands. There's a sort of Queen of Cups energy. Over the Eight of Cups, you got the Nine of Swords. With the Six of Wands, the Three of Pentacles. 
There to that Knight of Cups. Knight of Cups to the King of Cups to the Ten of Pentacles. My oh my. Uh, Sagittarius, Sagittarius, Sagittarius. Sagittarius, I almost feel like you got somebody trying to lead you away from a relationship or partnership. Because I feel like you got good energy coming in. My oh my. Sagittarius, who, who can you really sort of uh, trust here? There's, there's too much sort of under the surface type vibes here. With the Three of Cups there, now you got the Six of Cups energy. Someone could definitely be looking in regards to relationships or partnerships. Some of you who you choose to be in a relationship or partnership with. Someone knows you got a good opportunity coming your way. So some of you have a Crosswatcher energy. Some of you could definitely be getting catfished. Because the Ten of Pentacles, you got the strength and there's the creator. There could definitely be something in regards to someone's religious beliefs. And that could be a factor. That's sort of Nine of Cups or Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacle energy. This could be sort of the familiar energy around you. So, damn. You're like bringing something that's a little different. I feel like you've got some good energy coming in. So, uh, you know, ask the questions. Def some of you be mindful of the catfishing energy. My, oh, my, oh, my. You're so vain. You gave away the things you love. And one of them was me. You can't always get what you want and some hank williams jr right here my oh my you got an interesting sort of dynamic going on here sagittarius so some of you that could be the the sort of vibe damn sagittarius that's some old school energy so some of you if there's a sort of a religious uh If who your date is different from sort of the family vibe, there could kind of be some energy around that. I, some of you, I feel like it's religion. I feel like you have a controlling energy around you too. So, I mean, Sagittarius, how much of your decision making is based on you versus based on sort of like everyone else's viewpoint? So I don't know if you're like going to the family reunion and going to shake things up by surprising everybody with this relationship or partnership. Definitely be mindful of catfishing though. There's 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 some sort of manipulation going on over here. I don't think it's like all that negative, uh, Sagittarius, but do be mindful. You got some good energy coming your way. And I like that for you. But I think you are going to have to kind of pull focus back on you. So, damn. There could be some familial energy on this, Sagittarius. So, you could be kind of creating a new tradition for yourself. I definitely think you're you're switching things up, that's for sure. Sagittarius, for some of you, I don't think someone wants to see you fucking happy. Take what's yours and leave what's not. I almost feel like you get an opportunity that someone else didn't get. And that sort of changes everything.
I don't feel like it's all that dramatic, because some of you, this could be just, a, there's a lot of old school energy on this. You know what I mean? But damn, I think you're getting an opportunity to do something that's really going to be different for you. Close your eyes to open your heart. So when you start dating, or you could be in a relationship or partnership, and it's going to be different than what you're used to. So there's going to be something about it that's going to... It could be an issue. I don't feel like it's going to be an issue, but it could be an issue, right? I really feel it's around religion. You keep showing up. <laughs> you, you show up here, uh, Sagittarius. So someone could think that you're vain because you're kind of just doing your own thing. Kind of like, how dare you, Sagittarius? The four wands at the bottom. This is some interesting energy, Sagittarius. I like this. Especially those of you Sagittariuses who look at the person uh what they have to offer versus sort of some of the other things some of you it's a difference uh, in religion that's what makes the difference damn knight of pentacles with the will of fortune my oh my you got some good energy coming in but you got someone wondering what the fuck you're doing I feel like you're not afraid to sort of switch it up. Knight of Cups. Some of you could definitely be dating someone new. There's something different about this person that makes all the sort of... Uh, uh, it makes everybody sort of wonder what the hell you've got going on. I like this Aquarius vibe with you. You could be dating differently. So you're looking at your relationships or partnerships differently. This could be the first time you've actually had to deal with something like this, uh, Sagittarius. There's that Nine of Wands. Someone just feels like you always want to sort of pull attention to yourself. But I don't think this is really an issue with you. You know what I mean? It doesn't feel androgynous. Well, I mean, for some of you it could. Definitely be mindful of catfish and energy. But someone, someone here don't like this sort of vibe with you. Especially if you're happy, Sagittarius. My, oh my, what are you doing? You like shaking it all up, Sagittarius. The four wands there with the Pisces energy. You got the fool up there. You got the four wands. You got the star card and the sun card. The Knight of Cups, to the Ace of Swords, Ooh. to the Knight of Swords, to the Eight of Pentacles, and there you go, the Hierophant. Dang. Some of you could, uh, this is something about religion. This is something about religion. I feel like it, it's going to be a religious sort of uh, difference with you. It doesn't matter to you, but for some, it could be of importance. Damn Sagittarius. Damn Sagittarius. Some of you Sagittarians could run off and go get fucking married. Uh, there's like this sort of stir-up energy here. Now take what you're Sagittarius and leave what the fuck isn't. This is very interesting. This is either centered around religion or someone don't like the choices that you're making. But it's more on their sort of thought than what it is yours. But Sagittarius, I do feel like you know this would sort of create a stir. So you might have been keeping something sort of to yourself. My oh my Sagittarius. 
The drama ain't from you, though. The drama is not from you. Not a lot of love energy here, either. <laughs> so Sagittarius, you know what I mean? So damn Sagittarius. Uh, this could be your energy, Sagittarius. This could be who you're dating, who you're with, a partner. Do be mindful of catfishing energy. Something or someone is not who they seem. Uh, 33, you're at the divine white point. I feel like there's some religion on this. 3, 2, 1, jump. My, oh, my, Sagittarius, look at you go. Look at you go. Knight of Pentacles, the Mother Star, the Chariot, the Eight of, or Knight of Swords, the Hermit. There's that Five of Swords. Why do I feel like you're you're like really sort of switching things up here? Seven of Swords to the Page of Swords to the Ace of Pentacles to the Four of Cups. There's that Capricorn energy. Between Capricorn and the Chariot, there's that Magician energy. Over top of that, the Two of Swords. Who are you listening to? Who's this sort of guidance vibe with you? Because, I don't know, someone is kind of fake as fuck. There's not a real whole lot of love vibe going on here. If you're in a relationship or partnership, right, Sagittarius? For some of you, there's a religious difference. Most of y'all don't give a fuck, but it could matter to some. Your energy, their energy. There is this sort of stuck energy. There's some stuck energy here. Sagittarius, especially if you're just kind of going with your heart and just going with the flow here. Mm, Sagittarius. This is more external energy around this Sagittarius than you. But definitely be mindful of uh, catfish and energy. Sitting on the dock of the bay, watching the tide roll away. I want to know what love is. Sagittarius, some of you are going to really bring a nice little surprise to like a family gathering or something. All this water vibe energy. Someone could be getting married. Someone could be getting baptized. I don't know what this vibe is you got going on. I like it, though. You feel... Whatever this sort of energy is, you feel really good with it. But it's like the sort of external energies around it. So, damn. Damn, Sagittarius. If this ain't a relationship or partnership, Sagittarius, some of you could be changing your religion. Or uh, there could be some sort of baptismal energy here. Oh, whatever the hell you got going on. It kind of goes against uh, what everyone else's viewpoint is. But it's antiquated viewpoints, so it doesn't matter to you. 14, find your star family in this cosmic game of hide and seek. Temperance Angel, there you are. Ooh, you're going to do you... I like this vibe. But do be... Someone is definitely fake as fuck. So do be mindful of catfishing energy. If it's not like catfishing vibes, it's that sort of... Uh, someone is definitely fake as fuck. I like the songs with you, Sagittarius. You can go your own way. 
I feel like you're gonna break from tradition and do something different. Um, I don't feel it's all that dramatic with you. For a lot of you, it's really not all that dramatic. Not by normal standards. But if it's kind of like breaking the tradition up, changing the vibes up, right? My, oh, my, oh, my. My, oh, my, oh, my, Sagittarius. What's that Virgo energy? What's the Virgo energy? The Two of Pentacles. The Two of Pentacles. My, oh, my, oh, my. That is that sort of two-faced energy, too. So, damn Sagittarius. Take your time with something here. Um, if you're changing things up or you're looking at things from a different sort of perspective, right? Just sort of take your time with something here. Something is not that big an issue with you or for you. But, man, it could create quite the stir. You know what I mean? Uh, some of you taking your new partner to church. Some of you, this could be... Some, someone could run off and... Uh, Go get married. Uh, something definitely changes the family dynamic up. But it's not its not a bad energy. It's an antiquated energy. But my, oh my, oh my. Mm. Definitely be street smart and wise. And be mindful of catfishing energy. If it's not like catfishing, it's, uh, someone's definitely two-faced. So, damn Sagittarius. But, you know what? You can go your own way and do your own thing. Because it's really not that big of a deal. Not by today's standards. But it does sort of break from tradition. So you could be changing religions. Someone you're dating could be a different type of religion. And that creates a little bit of a conflict. Not for you. But damn. Do your thing, Sagittarius. Take what's yours. Leave what's not. Like, share, subscribe. I don't think someone likes the fact that you are basically doing your own thing. So if there is high expectations on you, someone really expected you to sort of uh, follow tradition, I think you're going to change from that. You're, you're going to switch something up. So that's that sort of vibe with that. Mm. Do you, Sagittarius? Like, share, subscribe. Ring the bell if you're ever so inspired to, Sagittarius. Go fucking be happy.